What's up, guys? Shadow Shade Two Eight Seven here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Dark Rising. And though I don't even remember what we did last part, but as you know, Coco is continuing to assist me anyway. Here we're in this cave called the Twilight Zone, and in this cave you can encounter legendaries like Celebi and Jirachi and Mew and whatnot, and you can catch them if you want to. And that's what we do. I think I'm not sure which ones. Um. Coco, uh, had caught, like, he caught some things, I just don't remember which ones. It's so confusing. Why is he using Surf? Never mind, now I know why. N never mind, I lied, I don't, actually. Because I'm a big of, I'm a big doofus, I'm going to have to figure out something to talk about for, like, ten more minutes. And that's going to be fun. Oh my goodness. Oh, he better not be using that Master Ball. Yeah, he better not be. I haven't seen this, like, at all since, uh, um, I'd, uh, completely succeeded and whatnot. And, uh, I have no idea what I'm talking about. Okay, okay, now I remember. I don't know, like, which ones he caught because I haven't actually watched this. This is the first time I'm watching it. And now we have an we have a Jirachi to encounter. Why do I feel like this is a very like boring part that this is going to be I'm, I'm just literally just going to be rambling for most of it. So I created so I'm working on this little story as a little tribute for the last 5 years which I'm making a very big heavy reference to because it the the last five years really meant something to me and whatnot. Man, this Jirachi's being a little bit of a Well, he's gonna use a Pokeball, that didn't even work. Jirachi is using cosmic powers. Cosmic 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 Jirachi. Jirachi is being me now. Come on, go catch him on. But yeah, I'm like writing the story basically. I don't know if I'll like submit it on YouTube. I can't submit stories to YouTube. I mean, I could read it, but do you guys really want to spend a lot of time hearing me read stories? Yeah, that's not what you want. That's not what you want to do it, like, at all. And man, is it being a pain in the rear end to write? But then again, there's a lot of things that are a pain in the rear end to, like, write. It's not really a pain, but it is a pain does that make sense it should I feel like it should make sense honestly cuz it could cut blah, 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 blah. I don't know <laughs> Landoras like it was fun it, it really got my brain racking I keep as I go along I keep remembering things that happen and it's really freaking cool and I'm so happy that I can go back and re remember all those very good times. It's great. I've I've no I know exactly where I'm posting it. It's gonna be on the forums. Well, that's a given. Cause it's like a tribute to what happened five years ago, April tenth. Cause that's the date I joined, up to when it closed, which is like January like first or second. I I put January first cause I remember like it was on New Year's or something that it had happened, and whatnot. Now, regarding to the Pokemon here, I have no idea, like, if there's anyone else who is, like, you know, around or whatnot, because, yeah, I, I just don't remember, because, like, even though I didn't record this for me, I recall, like, playing through it and running into these legendaries. There was Mew, Jirachi, what, Celebi, who else did we run into? I think that was it, though. Honestly. Okay, what the hell is going on? I don't know what's going on. Then he's going up here. Oh, hey, cool. Looks like a Florian ship. Oh, okay. where? What the? What? How come I didn't get to do anything there? Or he didn't get to do anything. I'm so confused. Hi, Sydney. We're welcome to. This is amazing, but I have some questions. What happened to you after the Battle of Kyurem's Den? I did a lot of thinking, but now's not the time to talk about me. Let's go inside. Well, you gotta give Shiro props for uh, 
wanting to do some caring about people. All right, what's going on? That's what we need to stop him. Great. We're all core region bad guys. As oh my goodness, he has control over every police officer. Really? Dang. Oh my gosh, that sucks. Huh. I'm just taking a moment to like read this, cause the, cause when I actually play through the game myself, I don't have the time to go ahead and read the dialogue, cause I'm just like, oh yeah, rah, rah, this game sucks, blah, 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 Dark Rising sucks, blah, 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 blah. I, I'm I'm basically like that. Oh, we got the meteorite for something for some reason, and a badge. Okay. We got a badge then. The meteorite will help you find the emerald. The badge will fool people into people. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes sense. Look, it's uh, Steve right there. I think that's Steve. Aw, oh, the PC isn't working. That's unfortunate. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Heal your team. Thank you. Goodbye. That guy had a cool hat. I don't know. I am a wanted boy. What can we do? What's going on? There's a dude in white right there. Who is he? I don't remember who that is. Oh, Hinkage. No. No offense, but I want to keep my ideas for Sorry. Okay, I am not enjoying this game. If, uh, if I could answer to that question... I'd answer I'm not having fun because I can do that and stuff and did be a uh, pretty cool not gonna lie not cool at all man the wait what was his name but man these are really difficult to talk over it's such a pain in the rear I'm seriously thinking about just taking a bit taking one of these videos putting them in a Vegas, speeded it up, put some Pokemon music with it, and call it a good day. I'm, I'm legitimately thinking about doing that. Because that would honestly be... Well, that would save me a lot of time, effort, and thinking. I'm all about that. I, I really need to finish The Walking Dead, I just realized. there's Like, that thing's been going on for just as long as Dark Rising, and that was a, quote, 200 sub-special. And my 200 subspecial is not even done yet. And I have to say, that's kind of pathetic. And I would not, I, I quote unquote would use other people's footage, but again, I only need footage like if I have absolutely nothing or if the game is like impossible to play. That's the only time I'll use other people's footage, I swear. But, like, the only thing with that, like, some people would make choices I would not have made, and I want to make the game go through with my own choices. And, like I've said with The Walking Dead, that game, like, the first season is all I'm going to be going up to with that. The second season, if I do it, which I want to do, is going to be a completely different um, playthrough, so you all know. Because I just want to go like that, and that'd be really good. Um, what else is there? With that, uh, I'm thinking about having the credits end with, um, it ends with the, uh, how does it end? With the, the, the DLC 400 Days. It ends with that. And that's something that we have to do. And I shall be doing, I have a little bit of the third episode that I have to render that. I should really just, like, dedicate a day to, like, Walking Dead work. But the thing is, the files with Fraps when I record, they take up so much space. They take up so much space. Rendering takes a good hour or so, and it makes my computer go pretty slow. Then, like, re-rendering, no, then, like, taking the bits, like, put them all together, do the things, save, close out of Vegas, because I don't want any black screens of em emptiness in my videos, because I have solved that mystery a very long time ago, and I've been doing that ever since, and I just don't want any of that to happen anymore, because 
Yes, you'll the Pokemon with a Pokeball, Coco. You are a freaking genius, my friend. Oh, God. I am running out of things to talk about, but yeah. Hence why this The Walking Dead is a very long and very... Should I say strenuous project? I'm not sure if you'd actually just call it strenuous, but like... I guess time-consuming is the perfect word to describe it. Yeah, time-consuming is the, the much better word to go ahead and describe it. Oh my goodness, for some reason my leg just started aching. I don't know why. Come on, Shadow. You just gotta think of stuff to talk about. Just for a little bit more. You only got, like, another minute. I got this. <laughs> My goodness, there's a lot of people. Hey, look, there's an old man with Raikou, Entei, and Suicune behind him. You can talk to him. Oh, crap. Okay, sorry, my thing, computer, like, went to a standby, sort of, kinda, I don't know. It's difficult to describe. Trainer, you showed compassion when you tried helping an enemy of yours that would not swallow his pride. Now I give you my loyalty in this battle. Okay. They're basically saying that they're going to help Shiro with everything in this part or for the rest of this playthrough. And then we stumbled upon this maze and this dark hideout. So that'll be all for this part. Thanks for watching. Thank you for more. Goodbye.